What's up NCAA players, man, this is Madden Talk 24-7 here with a tip out of the shotgun doubles formation. The play is called clear out halfback angle or in other books halfback angle. And the reads in this play are basically you have a unbump fade that X is on, you have a glitchy streak that A is on, and you have a great out route Y is on. And last but not least, you have your halfback coming across the middle of the field as your last read. So this play is very, very tough because Y is a man beater. I like to actually put Y on a slant or a whip. It really depends. Out of shotgun doubles, the whip route that I put him on, it gives him great separation. So I like to put him on that. And then you still have to account for the unbump fade. It cannot be bumped. What you want to do is... Throw it once it gets about 10 to 15 yards downfield, pass it inside, click on and go get it. And it's an easy catch. And then you have the out route. I really love that route just because it is deeper than the traditional out route. So it gets you about 15 yards instead of 10 to 12. Minor difference, but it adds up over the course of a game. And then it gets zone coverage. The streak and the angle route work off of each other so well. But at the same time, you still have that unbump fade that you have to account for. Look at this unbump fade right here that is open because I put Y on a slant and it took away the linebacker. So then it just one-on-one -on -one with the corner and the fade. So, and then you still have to account for the streak coming across the middle of the field. It's like an inverted streak. It's like a streak and a fade. You can hit the halfback angle route underneath. And then if it's open, you can still hit the out route and get zone coverage if they do not have any zones over there. So you have to account for all those options. As you see right here, I throw the unbump fade for a lob for about 25 yards. And then the glitchy streak. I really suggest having a really fast wide receiver there. I have my I have this guy. He's 95 speed right there. I like to audible down. Be because he will gain great separation every single time. Then you have the unbump fade on the left side of field that you can just pass the inside and click on and go get it. Then you still have, I mean, you just see the streak. It's just so tough to guard. It attacks zone and man. Then the out route, look at that right there. Got me 30 yards just off of a simple out route. Then the whip. Again, you want to have somebody who's shifty right there. It doesn't matter about height because you really need yards after the catch. And then the out route again. Big yardage with that out route. So I hope this play helps you out. And look out for more tips and gameplays in the future. And thanks for watching.